Did you know that today is opening day for baseball here in Metro Detroit? We're not talking about the Tigers. It's actually opening day in Utica at a brand new stadium. Paula Tutman is live at Jimmy John's and Field. And Paula, this is a local baseball out. league that uh, not many people maybe know about. Well, they might not know about it because it is absolutely brand new. First of all, take a look at this. This is probably the nosebleed section. You see how close we are. This is how this works. So you've got basically three different teams, right? They are all owned by the same person. They all compete against each, uh, against each other rather at this one stadium. And if you love baseball, this is brilliant. And it's play ball at the new Jimmy John's Field Baseball Stadium in Macomb County to a sold out crowd. It is the Detroit metro area's first professional independent league. Three teams, Utica Unicorns, Birmingham Bloomfield Beavers, and the Eastside Diamond Hoppers, rotating for the rest of the summer with high caliber play and a ready fan base even before the first pitch. Went online looking for tickets about four weeks ago. There was one ticket left for today. If ever there was a field of dreams, this is it. Yes, professional baseball, no, not a farm team, but by no means not a beer league either. We have a kid right now who's 6'10", but no one's ever taught him how to pitch. We've clocked him this last week at 94 miles an hour. He can get up to 97, 98. Talented young men ready to play their hearts out, like Austin Leyritz, whose father was a Yankee. He too had diamonds in his eyes until a serious injury. But I'm hoping any team will come out here, any scout will come out here and just get, get a look at all these guys. Because there's a lot of guys out here who have you know, slipped through the cracks and not really had the chance to you know, get looked at, which is why we're all out here today and you know, for the rest of this season. Same story for Miles Williams. There's doors that open, you know, one door closes, another door opens, and I'm, I'm, it's very exciting to be here. So I'm blessed with the opportunity to do it. This venue gives them the crack of the bat, the roar of as many as 4,500 fans, and another shot at catching the attention of someone from the big show. And in the meantime, fans get baseball, good old all-American baseball. Not a bad seat in the house, even in the nosebleed section. It's so close you can feel the spray of dirt as players slide to home base. I just love baseball. It's my favorite sport. It's wonderful, I like the Tiger Stadium. I am excited that we're a big baseball family. We're local here, we live five minutes away. Okay, so we are in the bottom of the eighth. Unicorns are up by four. We got a score of five to one against the Beavers. But guess what, guys? <laughs> They're all home teams, so you can't possibly lose. Incidentally, I checked some ticket prices. Over there, you see you have lawn seating. Those tickets are about $6. Cheapest price for Tigers is about $12. The most expensive ticket here is right down there in the front row, right there actually at the field, $40. You can really get a lot of baseball for a lot less, but you know what? They're not in competition with one each other. It's all enhancement. If you love baseball, it's an all win. And a beautiful day for it at that, Paula, and you're right, it's uh, certainly affordable. So for a lot of folks and right there in the neighborhood, like that one lady said, only five minutes from her house. So uh, very nice, thank you so much.